All right, let's begin double jeopardy. And we have two daily doubles awaiting you in these categories. Did you Did plan you it? Plan it that, that way. B is B for Bard. B is for Bard. B in quotation marks. What can Brown do what for you? What can Brown do for you? Amelia Earhart. Amelia Earhart. It's in the it's dictionary. It's in the dictionary and, and pop gals. Pop gals. Layer two. You start us off. Pop gals for four. The first five singles off her album Teenage Dream reached number one on Billboard's Hot 100 list. Okay, player two. Katy Perry. Yeah. That's it. <laughs> yeah, player two is correct. It's Katy Perry. Sticking with that category. This girl like me and Disturbia songstress was born in Barbados. Okay. Player one. Born in... Who is Rihanna? Ah! All right. How about player I go somewhere one, else? You're in command of the board as we continue right Did now. Did you plan it that way for four? Orbiting at about 67 million miles, it's the second planet from the sun. What is Venus? Let's hear it, player one. Yeah. Planet for 800. You get to its moon Ganymede is the largest in the solar system. The correct response is Jupiter. Jupiter. Oh, okay. Player one, the least dense planet in the solar system. It would actually float if you could find a big enough tub to put it in. Here's what we wanted. Saturn. 16. Player one. In 2005, NASA experimented with a low-pressure greenhouse to grow plants on this carbon dioxide-rich planet. It's player one. What is Mars? Yeah. Two thousand. Please. In 1781, it became the first planet discovered in modern times. The correct response is Uranus. Please pick again, player one. Dictionary for 400. A loud sound expressing disapproval. This New York City borough's cheer. It's player one. What is Brooklyn? Oh, so no. That's incorrect. Anyone else want to hazard a guess on this? Here's the correct response. Bronx. The Bronx. All right, let's try again. We return a Muslim holy war or spiritual struggle against infidels from the Arabic. Yes, player, player two. two. Jihad. <laughs> That's right. She was 2200. Player two, you start us off. Dictionary for 12. A hinged plastic case designed to hold a compact disc and usually a printed insert or liner. Let's hear it, layer one. What is a jewel case? Woo right. There we go. Dictionary for 1600. Okay, let's go. This tech acronym states that the integrity of output is dependent on the integrity of input. Here's what we wanted. Geigo. We return to you, layer Fish one. A dried and smoked ripe jalapeno pepper, which is dark reddish brown with a strong piquant flavor. Here's the correct response. Chipotle. Chipotle, okay. Layer one, back to Answer one of the yeah. daily doubles. One of the daily doubles.
You are currently in the lead. Let it be. 4,000. Answer? It wasn't deja vu when this member of Destiny's Child sang with Jay-Z on the song Deja Vu. Who's Beyonce Knowles? That puts you even further ahead. $15,000. Please pick again, player. Dollars. Fans go ape over this gal, born Stephanie Germanotta, who hit number one with Bad Romance. Uh, Let's player. hear it, player two. Player two. Oh. No, that's not right. Anyone else? Player one? Who is Lady Gaga? Yep. Oh, yeah, that's what we needed. Finish up the Player category. In 2005, she topped the album charts with The Emancipation of Mimi. Yes, player three? Mariah Carey. Hey, you're right. All right, I'll take player three for the Player three, 600. you start. B is for Bard for four. Gassy surname of Sir Toby in Twelfth Night. Player one? What is... Belch? Good for you. B is for Bard 800. Player one? This ghostly guy is described by the witches as lesser than Macbeth and greater. Here's what we were looking for. Banquo. Banquo. 1,200. Select his downfall was at Philippi. We're talking about Brutus. Brutus. 1,600. We return. Answer, the other daily double. Ah! The second daily double. I'll go for and you have the lead. Will it be? Okay, here is the clue. At the end of Much Ado About Nothing, Benedict quiets this love of his with a kiss. Uh, who is... Be who is Beatrice? Congratulations! Yeah, that's still right. first, player one. I go to 20 grand. Select again. In The Taming of the Shrew, she's courted by three men. So I got all three daily doubles. And I got them all correct. Here's the correct response. Bianca. And Bianca was what we needed there. Player one. Pick Welcome again. Brown defeat for four. He was Britain's Prime Minister from 2007 to 2010. Player one? Who is... Gordon Brown? Yeah. Right. Welcome Brown, DC for 800. Player one. On December 2nd, 1859, this militant abolitionist was hanged for treason. Player three? Sam Brown. No. So, not right. Anyone else? Player two? Not Sam Brown. We're talking about John Brown. John Brown. Same category. We return with his twelve thousand three hundred and thirteenth rushing yard. He passed Jim Brown on the all-time NFL rushing list in nineteen eighty-four. Oh, that was a long time ago. The correct response is Walter Payton. Oh, Walter Payton. You again, player one. The GK in the name of this Father Brown creator stood for Gilbert Keith. It's player three. Chesterton. Good. That's right. Player three, you start us off. Round 2000. Harold Brown was this president's secretary of defense. Here's what we were looking for. Jimmy Carter. Player three, choose again. Amelia Earhart for 400. Amelia's first plane was bright yellow and named for this songbird. 
It's player one. What is the Cardinal? Ooh. Oh. No. Down to 20,000. Anybody? Here's the correct response. The Canary. The canary. Player three, 800. back to you. In June of 1928, Amelia became the first woman to fly across this body of water, though she was only a passenger. It's player one. What is the Atlantic Ocean? Yeah. Correct. All right. Three clues left. Player one, Earhart you start. 2000. Amelia was promised her independence when she married a member of this prominent publishing family. Let's hear it, player what one. What is Putnam? Good. All right. 1,600, please. Player one, on her last flight, Amelia Earhart took off from this large island. Here's what we were looking for. New Guinea. New Guinea. Okay. And we'll wrap up the board with last one this for 1200 coming up. In 1935, Amelia flew solo in about 18 hours from Wheeler Field in this state to Oakland, California. Here's what we were looking for. Hawaii. Hawaii. Looks like you'll all, all be right. moving on to Final Jeopardy after this break. That takes us to the end of the Double Jeopardy round, and I've got a commanding lead. We've got the Final Jeopardy round here and for you. And the category today for Final Jeopardy today. This category. Sports, Sports business. business. You need to select your wager. Okay, I think I know this one, so I'm going all in. Let's take a look at that Final Jeopardy question. Final Jeopardy now. answer. In 1993, this man said, what Phil and Nike have done is turn me into a dream. Oh, and I actually saw this Final Jeopardy on Venice 1287's first game of Jeopardy for the Xbox 360. It's Michael Jordan. Do, 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 do. Lock that in. Let's Player see your two, what did you say? You said Mike Tyson, and that's wrong. So you lose all 600. You drop to zero. Let's Player see your three, response. you said Michael Jordan, and that's and right. You had 1,200. So that will bring you up to 5,600. And I say? said Michael Jordan. And that correct. So that doubles my score all the way up to $45,600. So that's how much we're going to add to our Halloween Thanks for playing. Bag. We'll see you next time. And... Oh, shoot. I don't even remember what the... Uh,
So that does it for this Halloween Spooktacular. I'll see you all again soon.